get this error code in NBA 2K25, which say 0x887A0001, then in this tutorial, I will guide you on how to resolve this issue. So make sure to follow these instructions very carefully. Now, in most cases, you need to check the system requirement for NBA 2K25. Go to this Steam page for this game, which is NBA 2K25. You can just search it here. Also, on this page here, scroll down to look for the system requirement. In most cases, a lot of people who don't meet the system requirement will always be facing this error code here. Now, I just need you to check here for the version. DirectX version 12 is required. Also, check for the GPU, which is graphics. NVIDIA RTX 2070 is the recommended requirement. Also, the minimum is this one, which is RTX 960. Now, you may have maybe meet this graphics requirement here for your PC, but also check here, there is additional requirements, which is you need a processor capable of supporting AVX2 and a graphics card capable of supporting DirectX feature level 12.0. So you need a processor that supports at least AVX2 for your game to play. Also, a graphics card capable of supporting DirectX feature level 12.0. Now to check if your graphics card supports feature level 12.0, just press window plus R and type this, which is DX. The arg. Now click OK. Now go here to the display tab here. Now check here for drivers section here. Now there is feature levels. Make sure your driver supports at least feature level 12.0. As you can see, mine supports this. It supports 12.0, 12.1, 12.2. So it supports various feature levels. So make sure also your PC supports at least 12.0. Now, we suppose also make sure your processor supports AVX2 as it is written here. You need a processor capable of supporting AVX2. Now, how do you know if your processor supports AVX2? Just press Window plus E. Press Window plus E. On this PC tab here, select property, right click and then select properties. Now, look for your processor name. Mine is AMD Ryzen 7 7435HS. So, for you, it may be different. Just you can either copy it like this. After copying it, then close this, come here to your browser, go to ChatGPT. You can just, you can either ask him if your processor supports AVX2. As you can see, mine supports. So you can see AMD Ryzen 7 75 hs does support AVX2. You can either also Google it. As you can see, I Google mine and it, it say, yes, the AMD Ryzen 7 75 hs processor supports AVX2. So make sure your driver supports, I mean, your processor supports AVX2. If it doesn't support, you may also be facing these errors a lot. Or maybe if you check the system requirement and ensure that it supports AVX2, also it has feature level 12.0, and it's still facing the same issue, now force NBA 2K25 to use DirectX 11 by using this in Steam Launch option. So you just need to type this in your Steam Launch option for this game. Just open Steam. After opening Steam, go to your Steam library. Now, right click on your game, which will be the NBA 2K25. So, yes, right click on your game and then select properties. And the on Steam Launch option, make sure to type this, which is negative DX11. After that, try to relaunch the game. If you're still facing again the same issue, just to remove it and then leave it as it was before. And then let's go to another instruction here. So, update your GPU drivers to the latest version. If you're using outdated drivers, also you may be facing this issue. So make sure you're using the latest GPU drivers. If you're using NVIDIA, make sure to use the NVIDIA app. Or if you're using the AMD, make sure to use the AMD Adrenaline software to update your driver. So I'm using NVIDIA. Open the NVIDIA app. Go to the driver section here. Check for updates by clicking this spinning cycle here to check for the latest updates. As you can see, my is up to date. So also ensure yours is up to date and we'll be able to resolve this issue. So that's how we can fix this record as you sit here. Thanks so much for watching this video and see you next time.